boat trailer is a boat, a trailer, and sometimes an ice fishing hunt, all in the same, same craft. It's a vehicle that you can take your ATV on land and water. The front is a drop down ramp, just kind of like a, the old World War II style landing craft. The wheels are retractable, the tongue folds up, and all comes with you. So when you, take, when you, when you get across the water, you can portage it with your ATV. It's basically the tool that allows you to go anywhere with a power boat and an ATV. You can actually get it in and out of the water faster than what you can a normal boat. Not only incredibly cool, but simple to operate. If you're using it as a trailer and uh, you're getting ready to launch it as a boat, just before you back it into the water, you take your trailering pins out, you back it into the water just till the point where the, the back of your boat is about a foot into the water. Uh, it only takes about five or six inches to float. So at that point, you uh, release the pressure on the, uh, the hydraulics in your transom after you've taken your, your pins out of the, the trailer hitch, you climb into the boat, winch your wheels up, Crank really easy. Close the, the doors that, that house the wheels, and you're ready to go. Simple as that. Simple as that. Now this boat will handle up to 1,500 pounds of payload. So that means we can put our four-wheeler on it, all our gear, us, and hit the trail. With a 30 horsepower motor, you can do about 22 miles an hour with a, with a moderate size load. Obviously, the more weight you put in it, you're going to sacrifice a little bit of speed. Uh, but you can take a... A large uh, ATV, obviously, as you see, you can take a full load of gear uh, and get from point A to point B in a hurry. It gets up on plane nice and easy. Uh, it's got a, a chamfer on the front that uh, helps it get up and over. Um, you know, the 30 horsepower motor's got, uh, got plenty of juice to get it to where you need to be. And best of all, this half boat, half trailer pulls like a champ. It's amazing. You know, I've towed it with small vehicles, big trucks, the trailer's you know, true and straight, and it can handle a decent sized load. It looks pretty funny, you know, everybody uh, turns and points, and uh, it looks like you're, you're towing your boat backwards. The motor's right near your, uh, your bumper, as opposed to on the back end of the boat, just like most people you know, are used to seeing. So when people see it, especially with an ATV in it, people just can't figure that out uh, at first. And you can see them, as they drive by, pointing and figuring out that the wheels go up. Well, I don't know about you guys, but I have a ton of stuff. I have a boat, I have a jet ski, I have lots of camping equipment, and when I go somewhere, I don't have a place to put it all. This, my friends, is the perfect solution. It's like a James Bond boat for the average man. I mean, you can transform it in, in seconds, and you can use it as a trailer, you can use it as a boat, you can use it as your ATV carrier, you can... You know, for the, with, a, with a winterized version, you put a top on it and have the ice fishing port. You can use it all year round. It's the only boat that you can use 12 months of the year. For more information about the float trailer, simply go to AdmiralDrive.com.